So they have actually released their state Q&A recording. CEO Sebastian, what's going on everyone? I'm NFT Lan and welcome back to another video. Now this video, you're probably heard some answers here if you've been watching all my videos from the start, but a lot of these are actually new. So be sure to subscribe for more NFT related content. I'm the only NFT channel right now and that's really awesome. We are growing super, super fast. It's great to have you here. I'd like to know what inspires you who you look up to in the world of music and business. And this is from the CEO himself, Sebastian. And um, I'm inspired by a lot of people, but the main thing that inspires me is the idea of doing good and sharing, which makes a lot of people very inspiring. I love to share. I love to share such news with you guys because I'm basically the main channel right now for NFT art finance and whatever they say, I report it through here. So I really hope, you know, that you get your information from both sources and but this is a really awesome idea like any idea where there will be an updated logo we already saw one they just updated an awesome site would you do weekly or monthly videos on your team would love to get them know much more since they will be truly innovating the world together yes we know sebastian we don't know the other team we only see it see them on discord sometimes but we intend to introduce you the entire team so you can get to know everyone a bit more when is the beta launch it's May, late may and i keep saying that in a lot of my comments we will first update our website which is a really good news because they already did that and make sure that our wanted functionality will be stable from the beginning then we will update you about the date for launch we'll provide you with updates along the way so this is really good updates along the way especially you know with them replying on discord and you know the progress has been kind of steady it has been steady you know they've been providing all the information we need wanted functionality will be stable from the beginning you know they won't release a crappy alpha that you know just will crash upon launch which i really like then we will update you about the date for launch how will the enter website interact with my wallets we will be fully integrated with both metamask and trust wallet the most two used wallets which is really nice what kind of artists can we expect to see on beta launch the beta will be mainly handpicked artists and we already saw a sneak peek of that now a lot of people know which one these are you know we got a few leaks we got a few teases but um we'll keep it a surprise for now because in late may we're probably gonna be seeing something really really good and will let us develop also guys we're getting huge info in about two days i'm guessing about three four five days something like that because tomorrow is actually or two days from now is monday so it's holiday for them in norway but then after that we're getting like big news i think on the burn as well so that's obviously massive we want this to be preferred place for artists of all kinds to create and sell their nfts will enter have a separate token from nft art no enter is the platform we're building around the community owned nft art token and this is what made me really wonder so they have enter.x right so this is basically sort of a sub platform where they, you know, provide their expertise or provide their uh, token economics for others. And then they also have token dot uh, NFT art or enter dot audio. I apologize, which is another thing. And it seems like NFT art will be used for all of that, which made me a lot of confused. Like, I don't want to see five tokens and I really support the idea. NFT art is also going to be, you know, N NFT audio, so on. So if you get me, just to recap, because I sometimes make no sense at all when I'm talking. No, Enter is the platform we're building around the community-owned NFT art token. This only increases NFT art tokens value. Will you ever have the ability to create polls for decision in marketing what direction enter will go to next? So this is a new question. We have plans to integrate some of all features like this for our passion projects and our charity events. And they never mentioned charity events before. This is like the first time I'm reading this and passion projects. Now I want to see what this is, but you know, uh, it's very, it's a very early coin. So we'll, we'll see what the passion projects really are because this keeps me very excited. To what extent does content creator include? Will YouTubers be included? Yeah, would I be included? I've been making a lot of videos about NFT art. Hopefully I'm included, but you know, <laughs> I'm just joking. Joking aside, firstly, we're making a platform for visual and audio related NFTs, which I totally support. But our future plans include all sorts of media, both physical and digital, live and recorded. And at some point I'll be putting, you know, uh, you can put your, I don't know, your own NFT video. So that's awesome. That's awesome. 
is the meaning behind the name Enter? What does it mean to you and your team? We want our platform to be a way to enter the NFT marketplace for all different realms of art and music. So NFT right now, I've been talking this in my videos. If you don't know me, I'm very passionate about NFT. I've been reading a lot about NFT. I think I know a lot of about NFT, so don't take me for granted. But right now, the NFT marketplace is super, super early. Just like I give always this example, but just like Uber was early, just like I mean, crypto was early back in 2011. NFT is early and it can definitely co-live with cryptocurrency. It doesn't have to kill cryptocurrency. That's the best thing about it. It can grow alongside cryptocurrency and people want to own things. As humans, we want to own a piece of something. So for example, a lot of people at young age want to own collectibles, right? So they want to own trading cards. That is one thing we saw like sports trading cards when you were younger. Now for me, this was like, uh, I'm guessing virtual skins. People are now owning virtual skins. But now people want to own, you know, digital stuff, uh, digital. It's Everything is going digital. You know, Farmville is a great example. And we're seeing, you know, people wanting to own from cars to owning houses, but no one can own a pristine copy. They can own, you know, just copies, but not the NFT, something that can't be replicated by itself. So this is really awesome news. And this is the NFT is basically proving that you can own something. So it can be either, you know, um, I don't know, a piece of paper and it proves you own that thing. It will prove it will be in the blockchain forever. It will tell you who it's sold to, you know, if the creator gets a cut. And I really support the idea if we had a physical art and then we get, you know, a token just like Beeple is doing, I think. And with our platform, we can fully scale towards each subculture's needs in a short time frame and can help curate different type of NFTs. So they're trying to help help the community is the most important factor they're not trying to take don't don't they're not saying buy our coin they're offering they're offering things that are gonna be in the nft platform and they're saying you know we can offer you this we can offer you this if you want to invest buy our coin it's not needed but it's gonna help us grow, right? It's gonna help you grow and invest into this project we are having. And 400,000 people seems like they agree with this, especially because we're reaching half a million. After half a million, it's just gonna be a super big boom. After marketing starts, like this channel is gonna pop off. How are you marketing enter.art to artists and musicians? What benefit would they receive from using your platform specifically to sell their works as NFTs? Thank you. Our low transaction fees and our transparency moving forward is one of the ways we will appeal, but the majority of our appeal is something we are still holding close to our chest. So the, the NFTs and you know the main low prices or low fees are not the main goal of what this site will bring. The main thing it will bring is something that it's still very important to know, like something very close and something that they have not revealed yet. And I completely forgot about this. And this just you no know, teases me a bit. Like, I'm really curious. What does this mean? I hope it means something good. And it definitely does. But I don't know what it is holding close to our chest. So at some point they will have, you know, to let it out to reveal it. When you say the community owns the token, does that make us purely responsible for marketing of the token or bring that enter has benefit from its price doing well? We will see promotion from you from the health of the coin. We'll spend from our development fund to market our final platform fully in a transparent way. And this is really awesome. Like we should be seeing some good stuff uh, in the following days. Will people be able to buy the NFT art token with credit or debit directly off the website? If not, I think it would be a good idea to explore the draw people in not so familiar with crypto. Crypto is not mainstream and it definitely needs more usabilities. Our goal is to find ways to do this after the launch. We want to do this organically and build long lasting value within our platform and future plans for it. So right now they have to grow the coin, right? The coin has to go up. Um, we're seeing sort of a downtrend, but that's because crypto is a downtrend as well. And I don't know a single coin that is going up unless it's like environmentally friendly. We want to do this organically, organically and build long lasting value within our platform and future plans for it. So they're going to be, you know, showing a lot more. Have you narrowed down a launch date for your beta late May? 
we may have to have the best platform ready for beta or they want and plan to have almost all functionality ready to scale so probably in the later parts of may because we can assure smooth sailing moving forward and we're only 13 days away so 13 days really goes by fast enter dot ceo please would you could you address the question about binance nft market direct competitor how are we different that they will release it in june binance nft is incoming it's gonna be probably pretty huge i'm gonna be talking about it but you know the devs aren't worrying about it we think it will have a different approaches and that we can happily live side by side so yeah uh enter listen enter nft is too competitive i mean too niche it has too many things to offer too many things that you can't get anywhere else that you can't replicate that you can't find on binance so far that they are very confident that you know people who will want to buy audio will have will be forced to go to enter nft right no other site can do this and no other site for that matter is that huge as enter nft right now maybe there's bigger nft sites that are already out but no one of them is offering audio so far and and enter nft is probably one of the biggest art sites that is going on and i think some organic competition is healthy and allows us specialize in areas where we are different we have a plan to make an nft festival after a pandemic of course and enter festival is already planned out after all everyone on our team has experience making small festivals of different sizes now this is awesome i want to see a small party i want to meet the devs at some point and hopefully in the future in a few years in a few months or this is the future if we manage to deliver on our promise to make this revolution happen and yeah they uh they gotta deliver and so far they are delivering a lot of people i see a lot of people saying you know the the site didn't do anything um i'm guy i got scammed um i'm in a huge dip bro it's only two weeks it's been like a month since this coin is out so in two weeks you shouldn't be even thinking about this coin you should be getting back by one month two months to see what's new and uh, definitely like building a good product takes work uh just launching a shit coin takes a day <laughs> I'm, I'm just here i'm just here to state out the obvious like this is how it works when will there be a live ama with an entire dev team and key a and key a is another dev after beta will introduce the entire team so that is in april no sorry I, I got it mixed up in june but we have something special planned before then and that's really really awesome i'm guessing they will show the office i'm not really sure what will we, it will be because there's so many things to show will we track the support game developers need to enter it's a big audience that is one of our long-term goals so also game devs in the nft space we have game devs closely connected to our team and are all thinking of big ways to integrate Will there be a fee when putting up artwork for sale on Enter? This is important. This is really important. A lot of questions I have already read, but this one is completely new that I remember that I haven't read at all. I tried to sell some of my digital art on OpenSea, but the fee was too expensive. And this turns a lot of investors back. Stay tuned for this. We have some interesting plans that I think will shake some stuff up. Oh, this just keeps teasing us even more. And like, I'm really interested in this one. Like, I see so many Reddit posts, so many tweets, so many comments. Open C wants a fee, um, and it even rhymes like, and it just gives you the basic idea of what's going on. At the moment, the developer wallet earns 14% of the total fee. I'll put the math. Correct me if I'm wrong. And the US 100 USD transaction, five USD will be burned, and five USD will be distributed to holders. Of these holders, the developer's wallet holds five quadrillion tokens, which is five for 13 of total currency available in the market. How did you plan to rectify it? So. We are currently working with our lawyers to find the best transparent way to deal with this, both with burns and other means. We're also looking for private investors that are looking for long-term options. We want developer fund to get back to 4% value without doing anything wrong with being fully transparent. So a lot of people are saying it's actually, you know, 14% of total currency is available on the market because it holds a lot more co uh, coins basically. And yeah, 5% USD will be distributed to the holders uh because you know the devs hold the wallet something you know they also get a bonus so we want a developer fund to get back to four percent so ten percent of the total you know coin market cap will actually be burned so that's awesome do the size of our project and crypto law in the world we have tread carefully because it's our focus to have a clear strategy to present to you before our public launch 
when do you see company in the next year? Ooh, that's a, a question I get a lot in the comments. Do you feel as we will be the market leader in NFT space or will we be in top five or 10? We believe in our project. I don't want to do other estimations than that, but our vision reaches further than I think we can explain with words. And they, you know, want to be one of the biggest, I'm guessing they want to be one of the biggest sites for NFT there is. Like not just for selling NFTs, for everything NFT. This costs a lot of money, but if this, you know, the first year succeeds, the second year will be a snowball effect, the third year, the fourth year, the fifth year, the sixth year, the seventh year, the eighth year, the 20th year, when you're, you know, probably already sitting in your Lambo, if you're holding at that point, uh, it should be really exciting news. Like, um, just think about it. Crypto is here for like, what, 10 years? And it's super, super early. Like all of these projects are starting up. We saw, you know, Bitcoin, Ethereum launching a long time ago. And now look at where it's at. You know, it made, made people millionaires. This is not a financial advice, but it should give you a clear indicator of how much I'm passionate about this project, how much I believe in this one. Some of these questions were already answered before, but this should give you a clear idea of the Q&A. A lot of upcoming things in the following month, especially May and June is just going to be insane with marketing coming up. Like they have so much going on. I, I already talked about the roadmap, so I don't want to go too much into it. But they have, you know, said about the marketing, a marketing campaign, you know, site launch. They have a lot more ahead. And this really keeps me excited. So if you want more content like this, I'm the only NFT art finance channel. So the only one. I don't think anyone is making like so regular videos as me. So thank you for subscribing. We've been growing massively and see you until next time.